check it twice I'll leave you a note right here Underneath the Christmas lights Carols and bells None of them help I still feel blue I just want to fall in love This Christmas Ooh. I don't need a fancy watch You can give the elves a break You can't make it in the shot You can't put it on your sleigh You know me so well Nobody else can do what you do I just wanna fall in love this Christmas We are headed to see some Christmas lights. Ooh. We uh, are Hoga County Fairgrounds. Yes, we're going to this thing called Magic of Lights, and it's at the Cuyahoga County Fairgrounds. If you live near Cuyahoga County or in Cuyahoga County, um, you're gonna want to continue watching because I will tell you how they are. I'm excited. We went to a really cool place last year in Lebanon. Uh, yeah. And um, uh, I'll look it, I'll look for it and I'll link it just in case you live in Nashville. It was the best lights we had ever been to. So, highly recommend going there um, if they still have it. I'm sure they do. do. Yeah, I'm sure. I think it's just at the Lebanon County Fairgrounds. County Fairgrounds. Fairgrounds. I think so too. Yeah. I will link it below though, um, so that you can check it out if you live in Nashville. But yeah, very good. So, you gonna call your mother? I was going to, but whenever you're ready. Yeah. Whenever um, you're done talking. Mitch is gonna call his brother back because he called him when we were eating dinner. <clears throat> so, we're gonna drive there. And I'll see you when we get there. So we did not end up going to see lights. We well, literally no, we did. We literally got there and the line was insane. And then we got into a huge fight. So we came home. <laughs> Why did we get in a fight? Because Mitch was being such a jerk. <laughs> no, I wasn't. Yes, you were. No. I've never been a jerk ever. Yeah, that's so true. Um Ooh, babe. What? So it's a balancing act of my camera. Yeah. So we first can't find the entrance. The entrance to this place is extremely hard to find. It is not, my GPS took me to three different entrances and none of them were the right ones. And then, so he was getting annoyed <laughs> that I didn't do enough prep before we got here. Um, because apparently finding the address wasn't enough. And then um, I had to pee. And that was also my fault that I had to pee. <laughs> you sound like that guy on TikTok. I feel like that guy on TikTok. <laughs> if you guys have ever seen this guy on TikTok, he's like, it's like reasons my wife is mad at me and they're just completely ridiculous. <laughs> that was him tonight. I had to pee, so he was annoyed that I had to pee. Sorry that I have to pee. And then... I, we passed it when we were trying to find somewhere to go and seriously, I have not seen a line this long since like Cedar Point in the summer. Yeah, the line was stupid. It was insane. So I was like, I don't even think that this is going, do you want to cheer so you can eat this? Well, it's, it's melting. Oh, um, cheers. I was like, I don't even think that the lights are gonna be that good for us sitting here for two hours. And so we just came home um, and we got Mitchell's. Mint, vegan mint chocolate truffle, best at Mitchell's. I don't like chocolate ice cream, but this is so good. And it has chunks of chocolate in it, which neither of their other vegan flavors do. So if you're watching this and you live in Cleveland, and you try not to eat dairy or don't want to eat dairy 
or don't can't eat dairy whatever this is such a good option um there are other vegan flavors are really good too the salted caramel is my favorite he likes the chocolate but i don't like chocolate ice cream but this is amazing so we're gonna enjoy our ice cream and watch a mindy but it's really good and um, yeah this was my i'm sorry for being mean yeah and a foot massage so foot massage there we go yikes <laughs> i need right. some water some I'm thirsty. Water. Some water. I peed on my water. Oh, that was the season finale. Yeah, last season. Mmm. That's sad. I know. Will she end up with Ben? Mm. I don't know. It's been taking forever lately. Hulu has. I know. All right, to end this vlog, I'm gonna do a little H&M try on haul. My stuff just came in that I ordered from Black Friday, and then I actually just went to H&M today and found a couple more things that I'm gonna show you. So first is this blue sweater. I definitely would not wear it with these pants because this sweater is oversized and these pants are kind of baggy, so um, definitely would not wear it with these pants, but I love this color. I don't wear a lot of color, but I feel like this electric blue will look so good with some... This electric blue will look so good with my leather pants, and that's what I planned on wearing it with. So, yeah, I love this color. It's not... It's cozy, but it's not very thick. So, right now, I actually have long underwear on because I'm wearing it today. But definitely would wear long underwear under this and with some leggings, skinny jeans... Them like high boots would look really good with this. Okay, next is this black turtleneck. I've been turtleneck sweater. I've been talking about this a lot, but I've been wanting a black turtleneck. Um, let's see. Cute. And again, definitely wouldn't wear it like this. I would probably like tuck it in. If I was going to wear it with this, oh my pants are unbuttoned. If I was going to wear it with this, I'd probably like tuck it in or something. Um, but love this. Super cozy. It is not knitted or anything. It's kind of like a fleecy material. Um, but it is nice and warm. And I love how the turtleneck is high. I think it looks so cute. Okay, next is this white sweater, and this kind of collar is super popular right now. I think it's called like a prairie collar or something, um, and you, you'll see a lot where they have lace, but I don't love lace. It's just not my style. I'm not really like a super girly, I like edgier leathers and denim and that kind of thing, black, and so... Um, I found this one and it has this collar which you could still is like trendy but it's not that like lacy girly um collar that you typically see i don't remember what these collars are called i'll look it up and i'll put it on the screen um but this is a little more fitted and i actually got this in the sales section in the store so that's nice and then i also got this black hat and my hair is up, so I am not going to try it on. But I just got this black knit hat. I really wanted a hat that had this, like, thick knitting. These thick, like, knit lines. Um, it is smaller than I thought it was, but that's okay. I don't have, like, a small hat, and so this will be perfect. And then I literally just got a plain black turtleneck that I'm not going to try on right now. Um because I don't want to take off my long underwear because I'm cold, but I noticed it came with this tag, and it's, like, made from, um, like, eco-friendly material. Like, I don't know if it's recycled or what, but I thought that was really cool. I'd never seen that, and I know H&M is, um, really good about recycling their... Um, clothes and I know if you take your clothes to H&M your old clothes they will recycle the fabric and then you get 10% off your purchase which is awesome so I just got a plain black turtleneck um, because I just needed one 
And then, I was so excited I found these today. So, I ordered a pair of boots like this from ASOS and the order like ended up not going through. And um, so, I messaged them and they were like, oh yeah, you can just reorder them. Here's a black, here's a code to give you the same discount as Black Friday. And then I hadn't ordered them yet. That was like yesterday. And I went to H&M and I found these and they are cheaper than the ones from ASOS. And I love this tall part on the boot. I love how it goes up. I think it's so cute and flattering and it makes you look pretty tall. So yeah, these are so cute. I'll have all this stuff linked below. So you can check it out. I'll try and find it. Um, yeah, so that's it. Thank you for watching this vlog. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you tomorrow.